Joining us from Washington, D.C. is Kentucky Senator Mitch McConnell. Senator, thank you for taking the time to speak with us. The confirmation of Supreme Court nominee Amy Coney Barrett has been approved by the Judiciary Committee. Talk me through the timeline leading up to a full Senate vote. Well, I'll move to this outstanding Supreme Court uh, nominee in the Senate on Friday. Uh, we will stay on the nomination uh, through the weekend, and she'll be confirmed early evening on Monday night and be seated on the Supreme Court shortly thereafter. The president's made an outstanding selection. The American people had a chance to watch her during the, the hearings. She's an extraordinary uh, intellect uh, with also an incredibly impressive family, uh, seven children, two of them adopted, one with special needs. Uh, she's led an exemplary life and is a great role model for all of us at a time when we, when we need uh, this kind of role model. Do you expect the Democrats to have any other way to throw up a roadblock between now and Monday night? Yeah, I expect them to make us cast a lot of uh, procedural votes, uh, things like motions to adjourn and that sort of thing. Uh, they're going to try every obstructionist uh, tactic they can, all of which can be defeated with uh, 51 votes. All of my members are going to be here. We're not going to be deterred about all of these uh, attempted detours that, that may be offered, and she'll be confirmed uh, Monday night. And Senator, there has been a huge emphasis on getting this accomplished prior to the election. Can I ask you, is it enough, do you think, to ensure Republicans maintain control of the Senate in 2021? Well, the vacancy exists, and the time that we've used to fill the vacancy is entirely consistent with what the time elapsed between nomination and confirmation of many Supreme Court justices in the past. So we're uh, not taking any more time than John Paul Stevens took or David Souter took or a lot of other uh, Supreme Court nominees. Uh, the vacancy exists. The president wanted to fill it. He sent us a great nominee, and we want to we want to confirm her. And that's what we intend to do Monday night. Senator, anything else you'd like to add? Uh, no, I think that pretty well covers it. Senator, thank you so much for your time.